Hi. Well, today I got something out here a little unusual. Well, this is a 1911, but it is chambered uh, in 38 Super. The 38 Super is a round that's been around for a long time, but it never became real popular, at least not in the United States. But you can think of it as kind of a souped up 9mm. It's a bit longer than the 9mm and it's got about 150 feet per second uh, uh, velocity advantage on the 9mm and you typically uses a little bit heavier bullet. I believe these are 130 grain metal case here. And these are plus P so they may even have a little more, uh, maybe closer to 200 feet per second uh, um, advantage on a 9mm. But anyway, I'm going to run a few rounds through it today, and I thought I might as well get a little of it on camera while I was doing it. Now these will vary a little bit. Uh, some uh, magazines for 1911 and uh, 38 Super will be uh, 8 rounders, and some are 9 rounders. This one happens to be a 9 round one. Now for some reason that did not lock the slide open on the last shot. So I got to load it up with just one round here and we're going to see if it does that again. Yes it did. Maybe that ammo is not quite as um, stout as I thought it was. Well, I'm not sure why that's uh, not locking open on the last shot. Since it uh, does lock open uh, when you just pull the slide back, I would guess that uh, this ammunition is not quite as hot as what it's advertised. But anyway, I got a full magazine in here again. I didn't bring any other magazines today. So I can't really uh, tell if it's uh, try a different magazine to see if it... Uh, is a problem. I've never had that problem before with this gun. And there we go again. Since it does lock open when you just pull the slide back on an empty magazine, I'm guessing this ammunition, uh, while it's advertised as being plus P, may be a little lighter than that. Well, the trouble I was having earlier with the uh, slide not locking back on the last round, uh, I'm going to say it's that uh, PMC uh, ammunition that's supposed to be plus P, but obviously is kind of on the light side. As you can see, you uh, pull this back, it locks open, so it's not, uh, I don't believe it's the fault of the magazine. But 38 Super is just a really nice cartridge. Good shooting cartridge, too. It's a pity it never caught on more, but it's a little niche cartridge that, uh, never actually went away either became a lot more uh, popular in uh, other countries uh, in Mexico, Central America, South America to an extent over in Europe but anyway I thought I'd just do a quick video with it so thanks for watching